Short sale specialist and default advocate answers, how long does a short sale take? Now, short sale specialist, default advocate, distressed property expert, and short sale agent Mike Wrigley here bringing you the latest short sale information. Thanks for joining us today. Hey, let's talk about how long a typical short sale takes. Now, typical short sale, is there such a thing or is it an oxymoron like jumbo shrimp or bankrupt millionaire? Well, while there really is no typical short sale, there is a format that many lenders tend to follow. The length of time, of course, is going to be depend on a number of variables such as who the lender is, how long it takes to get the financial package submitted, and the length of time it takes to get an accepted offer. With that said, in a balanced real estate market, it's reasonable to expect to get an accepted offer within the first 30 days of the property being listed. In the market we're in right now, two days is more like it. Now, the key to a quick approval is submitting a complete short sale package to the lender. This is where the cooperation of the seller is paramount. The longer the seller takes to supply the information, the longer it takes to submit the package. Ideally, before we get the offer, we have everything from the seller except the most recent bank statements and recent pay stubs. With the package submitted and confirmed received, we can anticipate one to two weeks in review before the liquidation valuation is ordered in the form of either a BPO or a full appraisal. The valuation process usually takes about seven to ten work days, two weeks. With the short sale package in and complete and the valuation back, if it is not already, the file will be assigned to a negotiator or asset manager. Some banks assign the file before the valuation, others after. It's really bank specific. Once the file is with the negotiator, it will be reviewed again to confirm the information is complete and updated. The negotiator may request updated financials or other minor details, many of which we already have supplied. Count on about another 7 to 10 working days for this to happen. Now, if the package is complete, the offer matches the investor's minimum net, and the servicer has delegated authority, the file will be approved and the short sale letter issued. If the servicer does not have delegated authority or the offer does not meet the minimum net, the negotiator will either counter or reject the offer. They also could take one third step and, and then send it to the investor for review. Again, expect another seven to ten work days if this happens. Once the short sale is approved, the close of escrow will depend largely on the ability of the buyer to perform. Most banks will give one 30-day extension to the approval letter, with VA being the exception and offering zero extensions. Now, so how long does a typical short sale take? From start to finish, on average plan, about four to six months. Some will be less. Some, like FHA and Cal Alpha, will certainly be longer. Now, is a short sale right for you? I don't know. Give me a call. To get a better idea of when your home will be worth what you owe, log on to www.shortsaleandloanmont.info for a free estimate or call me today for a free consultation or updated short sale information. We look forward to hearing from you.